Well, guten morgen, everybody. It's time for one of the silliest first tens that probably ever will be. The VSHL, which is a test drive currently for the German 3.0 premium mine layer. So we'll see how this goes. I anticipate it's going to be pretty ridiculous. Put some artillery there to start. It does have smoke. It's got 16 mines. And um, we're just going to go as fast as we can here. See if we can get into A and just drop all the mines that we can drop and see what happens. This is a 3.0 premium boat. Turn, turn, turn. Drop smoke. Smoke, smoke is good. Turrets can't get low enough. Turrets did a little bit of damage. All right. Hey, we got a kill assist. Wish this thing had some sort of torpedoes. That would be great, but I understand why it doesn't. Oh, Lord. Time to start dropping mines. Just drop mines everywhere. Drop all the mines. Well, all right. We'll see you in battle two. Okay, here's battle two. Should be a little less um, immediately involved in battle here, so we'll take care of a couple things. It's the 18th of November. You can get the test drive of this by winning seven battles. I'm a little late on this one, I understand, but um, you win seven battles with 50% or more battle activity until the 19th at 0130 UTC time. And you get a 24 hour test drive of this thing. It's a 3.0 premium. I don't anticipate I'm going to get the full premium benefit of it, but uh, I did unlock, spade out the uh, other little boat I had and um, get a little bit of a benefit um, unlocking a new unlocking a new ship in one battle, which of course is not surprising at all because it's a reserve boat. But all right, so generally they come up this way. I'm going to wait on artillery till we. There we go. There's one. Here they come. The Alright, they're marked right down there. We'll put artillery right there for them. Probably a bit out of range. Yeah, they're probably a little bit out of range, but we'll put some shots down, down range at them anyways just to see if we can reach. Can't tell if we're making it or not. Okay, let's do a little smoke on. For doing 47 miles an hour, it sure doesn't feel like it. I guess we're, we're up out of the water well enough for the hydrofoil, but it doesn't feel like it at all. Now, what I plan to do is make a run in there and just mine the heck out of the... Uh, oh, there's a target up there. That's going to be an issue. Can't see it, though. I guess they can see me. Oh, dear. Better start dropping some mines, I think. This thing's probably going to be terrible. Apparently I can't drop mines right now. That's cool. Because I was stuck in the... Alright, here's battle three. I'm gonna see if I can make it to uh, B, I guess. Seems like a really bad idea. Driving this boat seems like a really bad idea, but it is fun. I'm not really expecting any miracles or anything. I like that ship too, that's a pretty good one actually. The old patrol craft, oh my god, they got artillery out on us. Come on, boat, move for the love of god, oh my god, seriously? Oh my god, it's their entire team! Oh lord! My God! Okay, here is Battle 4. So far, 
It's going about as well as you might expect the shell boots. Mine laying boats to be going. Oh no. Don't do it. Don't do it. It's got some pretty sick Tokyo drift on it though. I'll give it that. Okay. Um, I'm going to head to B. Because I want this battle to last more than eight seconds. Oh, look at this poor guy. All right, let's get this sucker up out of the water. Sorry. Sorry, Yumi. Oh, God, they're shooting at us already. Uh, let's put our artillery right there. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> that was right over me. Oh baby, we need to fly. Oh, Yumi went off on the attack. Good man, Yumi. I'm just gonna try and get to B as fast as I can. All right, this battle might last longer than eight seconds. Okay, so uh, I've got a 15% line booster on. What else? Um, my research is currently set for the S38B. I managed to research the S38, the first S38 in the first battle. Goodness, oh man, that dude really wants to be dead. Ha! Have at you, you varmints. Schweinhund, Schweinehund. Uh. Oh, sure, why not? If you're gonna let me help repair a boat that's right next to me, like 200 feet away, sure. I'm helping you repair from way over here. Hooray! Ha! I don't have no idea how it. Lo oh my goodness, that's not good. Oh my god, it's a full on destroyer. I, I like how my guns are just shooting the sky, so that's cool. All right, straight into B. Is that a target right there, or is that uh, no? That's uh, one of the little AI scenery decoration boats. Oh dear. Oh, that is not good. Oh, that is not good. We're taking hits. We're taking hits. I think we got slowed down a little. Ah, we certainly got slowed down a little. Okay. Team has almost made it to B though. Hopefully we can get there in time to put some mines in it. That'd be really nice. I did not get any mines with my mine laying efforts at the first uh, first battle, unfortunately. All right, we're speeding up again a little bit. Can we get up out of B? Well, that's a target. That's a target. Is that the destroyer? I sure hope not. Oh my god, it is, isn't it? Can we get some range estimating happening here, game? can't tell if I'm actually reaching him or not. Oh, yeah. Yes, I am. All right. 15 mil turrets actually hitting something. Not doing any damage, but we hit him. Okay, start dropping mines. Start dropping them mines, boys. We're going to heavily mine this harbor right here. Why are we slowed down again? Mine for you. Mine there. Let's get all these mines off. Anybody tries to come take this spot back, they're gonna get a, hopefully an ugly surprise. I'll save the last couple for right over here. Okay. Now let's reload some mines and run away. All right. Oh my God! Did they just detonate one of my mines? Well, they detonated me. Oh my God! Well, after the success I had on this map previously in the PT-200 first 10, how could I not try and streak my way up to the sea point? So that is what I shall do. All right, here we go. Hydrofoil away. I'll even put down some smoke for any teammates that want it.
So let's see what we can do in battle number five. Battle four at least lasted longer. I did not get any kills with my mines, though. By the time the very, very end of the battle, we dominated them pretty hard. By the very, very end of the battle, um, a destroyer was just pulling in to the B-cap. This kind of sucks. Man. Come on, get that fire out, boys. Holy tracer fire, tracer fire. I want to get that smoke on. I want to get that smoke on quickly. Jeez. Smoke out again. My goodness. I don't think they like me very much. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to need any help at B or C either. God, they're still hitting me from that far. Oh, come on! Jeez! <laughs> okay. Bring it in towards C. Crew is at 6% health. Look at my boat. Good God. I wonder if that one mine is out. It still shows 16 of them. I wonder what happens if... Because the mines apparently don't act as an ammo rack. It somewhat seems like they should. Okay, we're going to steer towards C so that as soon as we detect enemy contact, we'll be able to hit smoke and then turn away from the enemy contact and probably not uh, have that save us whatsoever. All right, on the mean, in the meantime, though, I'm going to... Well, I was going to say I'm going to put a couple mines down right here, but I'm not yet. Okay, we're almost into C. Thankfully, it's a humongous capture point. Does anybody else feel like this thing is going like two miles an hour right now? I guess because there's no like flying wake or anything. It feels like the boat's just barely moving. Look at that, we made it into C. Okay, smoke on. There's our friend. Our friend, the enemy boot. Finish him! Finish him! Couldn't get any mines off. Well, I got a couple mines off. Couldn't finish him. Okay, here's battle six. We're gonna try and go around a little higher to be... Maybe let these guys go in ahead of me. And capture it, and then uh, let's watch this from the side. Get up out of the water. Oh, well, too late, I guess. See if these guys can get in there ahead of me and capture, and then we'll come in and lay mines behind. This is probably going to be one of the shortest first tens I'm ever going to have. <laughs> it's pretty funny, though. I mean, it's it's equal parts. It's like it's a little bit frustrating because this thing is difficult to do really well with. But it's funny just because it's almost a meme vehicle at this point. Oh no! Now my video is gonna get banned in the EU. Damn it! I shouldn't have said meme. Except the actual thing with memes is just copyrighted material, so I'm okay saying the word meme. Oh my god, I got a hit with my artillery. See if any of those actually hit. I kind of doubt it. Oh, cut short before those torpedoes. Oh lord, not good. Tear him up, boys. Please get some actual hits on him. Alright, we're going to put some mines down. Hey, we got an assist, alright. Couple more mines right here. 
you guys go ahead of me. Ah, enemy boat coming. Enemy Russian boat coming. Ooh, ouch. Oh, sorry. Oh, that's not good. There we go. All right. Whoa, that's equal parts scary and good that I was stuck on those rocks. That little dude fired a torpedo at us. There he goes. Oh, I think that's an S-100. Put some smoke down. Drop a mine and get out. I think they, uh, that mine just blew up because I was over the top of it. Just going to drop all the mines I can drop right here. Okay. More mines down. Okay. Alright. Almost feels like it worked. Bring those guns down, fellas. What? Well, so be it. Best one I've had so far. Okay, here we go for Battle 7. Um, well, as we spawned here, I guess we're going to try A, even though it's not a great idea whatsoever. Alright, let's get a look at this boat lifting up out of the water here. Check out those animations. It's not too bad. Alright, we don't have any artillery we can fire just yet. Alright. Okay. Standing by with artillery. Got a BS-10 in front of us and an S-100, okay. Got artillery right there. See if we pick anybody off. Look at that, you can actually see the artillery coming in from the sky, that's pretty neat. You can see the shells coming in. I wish I had torpedoes. <laughs> Let him have it. Let him have it, Klaus. Open foyer. Ooh, well, we almost did some useful hits. Straight ahead. Straight ahead, Klaus. Yeep. Klaus, light him up. Got him! Good job, Klaus. Oh. Better put out those fires, boys. Well, we got one. Got a couple of mines off. Okay, here we are. Battle number eight. go really well. I'm sure. I'm sure this is going to go exceptionally well. <laughs> Get them guns ready, fellas. We're going to need them. Yeep. All right, good. An assist. It's good. It's a good start. Is he dead? He is. No, he's not dead, is he? Wait, yes, he is. Uh oh. Oh dear. Not good. 
can we get off of that? I hope so, because we are otherwise very badly beached. Ah! That island cost us. Okay, here is battle number nine. We're gonna make a run in for C, or B rather. I'm looking at I'm looking at C on the map because that's where I normally go. But this time I'm gonna try B. Up out of the water, Heinz. Let us go faster. Schnell. Nein, Kamerad, Captain Leutnant. It's not schnell. It's shell, shell boot, not schnell boot, shell boot. My number is a little off, a little off center there. Boats indeed. Nice. Typoed that. Darn it. All right, already. Okay. Onward we go. I wonder if I drop a mine here, if it'll be visible, or if there's enough depth for it to sink. Like right along those beaches. Enemy contact. PT boat. Not good. Not good. I could cut through the middle here. Alright, better turn the smoke on. Come on, boat. Bring them guns down. Oh god, it's a PT-200. He's shooting rockets at me. Oh boy. Yikes. Leave a couple mines behind for him up here, in case he makes it through. Hits into him right there. Hey, hey, there we go. Oh no. Uh oh. Oh boy, I don't know if I can get off of this. Oh dear. Thank you. You're the man, Dr. Watson. I hope you can actually get me off of this. Uh, you didn't exactly attach on. Well, this is embarrassing, but funny. At least I got a kill first. How are my mines looking back there? There's a couple of them back there. Let's see if he can actually push me out of here. I mean, looking at my boat. There was a teammate there. Oh no. Well! Alright! Well! We've arrived at Battle 10 already. How about that? We're gonna head our way 
I'm gonna see if I can make it all the way out to the C point, actually. Because why not? Alright, here we go. I think part of the illusion to me that this thing isn't going very fast is the fact that we're doing 47 miles an hour and there's no wave splash effects whatsoever. I think that's why this thing feels like it's not moving. Like, waves splashing and being cast aside feel like they would probably help. Don't know. Anyway. So far, despite the activity with the mines, it's been a kind of a hilarious thing. Before I get to the first, or the final thoughts, I would say that most likely this thing would be very useful as a secondary vehicle, like your second boat, after you get in and capture, or potentially in like a two or three or even four person squad, and let two to three really fast guys get out ahead of you. Oh my god. Oh my god. How hilarious. I don't have my RD for them. They're so far up there. Well, here's hoping I can... Ow! Oh. Make it out there ahead of those destroyers. Didn't do too much to him. Come on, baby. Fly. Fly forward. Fly forward. Oh my god, if those destroyers hit me, I'm absolutely toast. Okay, start smoke screen. Turn in towards them. Still can't see him on my artillery radar. Start dropping some mines. Dropping all the mines I can drop here. Well, I got all the mines I could get. I don't think they'll probably get much, but... Alright, well, final thoughts for the VS-8 Shell 1, I guess. Shell 1. Um, I don't know that it has a particular niche in the meta right this very second, but I think it will be useful. Like I was saying during Battle 10 there, I think that it will actually be a useful vehicle if you're in a squad of like two to three or even four players and you have three good fast PT boats or fast little dudes go flying into the cap and capture it. And then you go in and um, lay mines behind it to... Uh, you know, prevent a uh, counter capturing. Oh my god! <laughs> well, I was gonna make a uh, Schnell bomber run on these guys, but I think what we're gonna do is come in really low just over the island here. Um, it'd be funny if those destroyers run into my. I don't think I'm gonna make it, but I'm gonna try it. It'd be funny if those destroyers ran into my. No! Um... Oh, didn't get the bombs off! I just started hitting the bombs. Alright, I'm actually going to do something I've never done before and use a backup vehicle for a first 10. And what I'm going to do here is go shooting up in between the gap between B and C here and try and lay a string of mines there for those destroyers coming in, or even right here maybe. Try and protect B from those destroyers pushing in. So I'm still going to continue the final thoughts here, and then if anything exciting happens with the... Uh, mines there, I'll show it. I do have at least one little bit of bonus footage for this before I forget. Otherwise, um, 
Yeah, this thing's interesting. Um, you got to watch out for sandbars and stuff. And if you roll in, that's got to be somebody's minds exploding. Oh no! Come on! No! 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 Okay, gunners, maybe you could shoot at the actual thing that's hitting us there. Please don't run aground. Please don't run aground. Please don't run aground. Okay. Another one in front of me here. Is that one of the destroyers already? I think it is. Yep, sure is. They're taking B, so it almost doesn't matter. Okay, anyway, um... Still gonna. Oh my god, there's the other ones right there. <laughs> this is gonna go very badly. Best thing I can do is just keep laying mines and keep marking them for my guys. 80 second repair. Oh my god. Ah! Well, okay then. All right, I can't think of anything else to talk about for final thoughts, so uh, we'll see if those mines get anything. I rather doubt they will, and, um, well, there's a kill assist with a torpedo. Nice, nice TBF kill. That uh, assist should go up to my, should go towards my shell boot, but it could potentially be from the JU-88. I don't know. I think it registered a hit with my JU-88, even though all my JU-88 did was crash into it. But at any rate, uh, we'll wrap this up here and we'll say thank you all very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoy this one. Um, I don't think I left anything out specifically. Um, and we'll see you all next time for more War Thunder Boats. Let me know what you guys thought of this one. And if any of you think there's a particular useful niche for the... Uh, VS8, let me know, and we'll see you all next time. Take care, everyone, and have a great rest of your weekend.